Since ancient times, bamboo has been used in numerous ways by people in Japan. Attractive and durable, it's an important material for the implements used in the traditional tea ceremony. Today we'll look at bamboo ware and some of the many ways in which it's made and used. Bamboo is a group of plants that are members of the grass family. It grows widely throughout Asia and there are more than 600 species in Japan. Because it is so light, strong and easy to work, bamboo makes a very versatile material. For centuries it has played a central role in people's lives in Japan. The city of Kyoto was founded over a thousand years ago. Walking through the streets, you can feel a sense of history. Bamboo is incorporated as a material both inside and outside many of the buildings. The walls of many houses have low curving fences, known as inuyarai, which protect the walls and stop them from getting splattered with mud. They make a graceful addition to these traditional street scenes. Shishi odoshi, a length of bamboo that slowly fill with water, then empty out, making a knocking sound. In the past, they were used to scare away animals and birds, but now people just like the rhythmic sound. The ritual of the tea ceremony involves many aspects. The tea room itself, the implements used to prepare the tea, and the food served with it. And when it comes to the implements, bamboo is one of the most important materials. First, a bamboo scoop is used to transfer the powdered green tea into each tea bowl. Then hot water is poured into the tea bowl using a bamboo ladle. The hot water and the powdered green tea are then mixed in the tea bowl. This is done with a bamboo whisk. Whisks like this are made by cutting the tip of a bamboo stem into as many as 130 delicate slivers. These are used to whip the tea into a froth. Without bamboo implements, there can be no tea ceremony. It was thanks to the 16th century tea master Sen no Rikyu that bamboo implements became so important in the tea ceremony. This is a vase that was made by Rikyu. He used it for flower arrangements to decorate his tea room. Before Rikyu, flowers were displayed in ceramic vases. It was he who introduced the idea of using bamboo as a material in keeping with his aesthetic of austere simplicity. The simple, natural appearance of bamboo became an essential aspect of the tea ceremony's philosophy of rustic simplicity, wabi in Japanese. This is the workshop of bamboo artisan Kuroda Shogeng. He is the 13th generation of his family to work as an artisan making tea implements. His family is one of ten with a special link to the Senkei schools of the tea ceremony. Kuroda carries on a tradition dating back to Rikyu himself. Special containers are used to hold powdered tea for the tea ceremony. The depression in the lid of this fine piece comes from the natural shape of the bamboo. This water container is made of soot blackened bamboo. Each piece of bamboo has subtle variations in hue and they have been skillfully arranged for the best overall effect. Worked and shaped by skilled artisans, these tea utensils highlight the profound depth of beauty inherent in the bamboo. 